Hey everybody, Bezad here alongside Risa. Hey everyone. And today we've got the brand new Golden Hour Slub Stretch Selvage, the latest release part of the Naked and Famous Denim Spring Summer 2022 collection. We're gonna go over all the details, give you our thoughts and opinions, and that way you'll know everything you need to know about these jeans. So Risa, why don't you kick it off with the specs? Mm -hmm. So Golden Hour Slub Stretch Selvage is 12 ounce Japanese selvage denim. And as the name suggests, it is a slubby denim. And we also added 2% stretch for comfort. What makes Golden Hour Slub Stretch Selvage special is the color, I have to say. Right. I mean, as the name suggests, Golden Hour, it's got this beautiful warm tone, very reminiscent of vintage style natural indigo dyed jeans. But what sets these apart a little bit more than that is its texture. As you can see here, the fabric is kind of streaky and that's because of the use of something called slub yarns. Now, slub yarns are kind of like the your, your grandmother's knitting yarns. They're very thick in some parts and very skinny in others. And when you dye this yarn, the thicker parts absorb more indigo and the skinnier parts absorb less indigo. And then when you weave with it, you get a very kind of textured, fabric throughout. So you've got this denim that is very textured and then you've got these beautiful high low points, but they're not a typical high low point like you would find on a like dark denim indigo. It starts at a mid blue, so you've got darker, you know, shades of mid blue and lighter shades of mid blue throughout and it creates this very beautiful warm tone. And lending to the tone is the inside, the weft. Now, if you take a look on the inside, you'll notice that it has like this natural colored cotton weft on the inside, and that peeks through on the front face of the fabric, so it adds even more warmness mm -hmm. to this jean, which I, I really love, this color. Mm -hmm. And this denim looks really textured and interesting when it's raw, but it's also going to be even more special when you start to see the fades. Right. And for anybody who's been with Nick and Famous Denim long enough, you might remember the Dragon Ball Z collection. Mm -hmm. This same fabric construction was the same used in the Goku denim and the Cell denim. And I'll put up some faded uh, images of that up here so you can see. You can understand the type of fading potential you're going to get from the Golden Hour Slub Stretch Salvage. I think it's going to be quite nice. And what else I really, really like about this denim is that it is a, it's a mid blue, mm -hmm. and a lot of guys, you know, they're starting to get into that. We're not, in the raw denim world, it's pretty dark for the most part, and the mid blue gives you a chance to experience raw denim in a little bit of a different way. You know, we're talking about fading, but mid blue is kind of like a, it's a little bit of a cheat, because you're starting at a lighter denim already, right? Mm -hmm. You know, you're, you're probably like 30% uh, already into these jeans when you start fading them. So you'll get to a finished faded light blue result even faster when you start off with a, you know, lighter colored, natural colored uh, mm -hmm. indigo denim. Yeah, you might see a little bit less contrast in, depending on, you know, if you start with dark, dark denim and you, you keep that color in s certain parts of the jeans and you see like, you know, you fade to white, you see a little bit of less contrast. But overall, I think th these kind of lighter blue denim just gives you a little bit more, um, more brighter. Um, brighter blue fades yeah. overall. It, it's, to me, it's, it's, it's more of a vintage blue fade, yeah. right? It, it, at least you achieve it faster. You can certainly get it with a darker denim, but mm -hmm. with this, you will get it a lot faster. Right. Right. And now we have this denim, the Golden Hour Slub Stretch Salvage, say that three times fast, uh, available in our men's super guy, weird guy, and easy guy, but you decided to put them in our ladies' fits in all four fits. Yeah. And so those are our high skinny max. Uh, Arrow, which is the new straight leg fit for women, and uh, classic. So we have everything um, available in these four main fits for women. And the reason for that uh, is, I mean, first of all, the 12 ounce weight is, is perfect for any kind of fit. And added to that 2% stretch, that makes it very easy to break in, even if your preference is a skinny jean. So, so say high skinny, you you're gonna have a hard time if you're dealing with heavier non-stretch uh, fabric, but with 2% stretch, 12 ounce, it is a great way to get into those skinny fits as well. And most importantly, I think there's a lack of slubby textured denim and women's fits world, right. just in general. So um, we just, we're just we very excited to introduce this very slubby texture in women's fits. Yeah, I mean, as our audience grows, they're demanding more and more from us. So, you mm -hmm. know, we can get uh, slightly more hardcore fits into the ladies' line, and uh, maybe maybe one day we'll get some elephant denim in the ladies, huh? 
We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll, we'll get there. Okay. So let's go over some of the details of this denim. I mean, the first thing you'll notice is that beautiful uh, English tan leather patch here on the back with the Naked and Famous Denim Tragic Blonde uh, logo here. We've got the tobacco colored thread, which I really like. It's a very vintage style look. And then we've got the uh, silver metallic hardware. This is all made for us. Custom made with uh, our Naked and Famous Denim text and J'adore Tout New here on the rivets. These are all made for us by YKK in the USA. On the inside, we've got that classic red line salvage ID. Now, Risa, you put it in all four ladies fits. Who do you think this denim is for? You probably can guess that I put it in all four main fits of women because I believe that this denim is for everyone you know okay pe people who are into slim fits who are into more classic you know wider fits people who are new to raw denim people who are have experience in raw denim i think it is literally perfect for everybody right and i, I agree with that mm -hmm. i i think this is a great gene for those people who are you know we've been in the raw denim world for a while um, you, you have a lot of dark denim indigo in the closet. You've got your duck, you've got your gray, you've got your black. You know, you've been fading jeans for a while, but sometimes it takes a long time. You want to get into this. You want to fade your jeans fast. And the fact that you've got a slubby texture here makes it a little bit more hardcore. And the fact that it's got a little bit of stretch, and especially for, uh, you know, some of you guys out there who've been with us for a while, you know, I've been, I've been graying a little bit, been getting a little bit older. Comfort starts to become a little bit more important for me as, as I get older. So you've got that comfort factor here as well. So I, I, I really like this for veterans of raw denim. I think it's a great option to get into. Of course, if you're new, this is a great chance, mm -hmm. uh, you know, great way to start. You know, it's an advanced way to start, I would say, because Mm -hmm. A lot you of people, some yeah, steps. you skip some yeah. steps. You know, you, you most people start off with like a, a very basic dark denim indigo. Mm -hmm. And here you're getting into like, you know, a, a lighter shade indigo with a little bit of slub. But you've got the stretch because maybe you're coming from, a, you know, a comfort denim world. And you want to be able to break these jeans very mm -hmm. easily. Break these jeans in very easily. And speaking of breaking in time, because of that stretch, these jeans are going to be very, very comfortable right off the bat. It'll only take a day or two or so to break these in. They're going to be very comfortable mm -hmm. uh, with that respect. So uh, I think... I think that's everything. Mm -hmm. um, so if you have any questions or if there's something we missed, uh, leave a comment in the comment section below and we'll be happy to answer your questions there. We've got a blog post linked in the description below with a complete listing of all of our retailer availability. And if you want to have your questions answered live, we do a live stream right here on YouTube Friday evenings at 7 p.m. Eastern. Uh, so subscribe to the channel and hit the notification button and uh, you'll know every time we go live. And follow us on social media. I think I'm rambling on now, yeah. so I'm going to end the video right here. Thanks for tuning in, everybody, and we will see you guys next time. All right. Bye, Bye everyone.